Aloha and welcome back. I'm Fade Panther and this is Detroit Become Human. I don't remember if I was using a controller. No, I was using mouse and keyboard. Right. Let's see how this goes. Turned away, he's facing me. He is clearly not looking at me. Lieutenant Anderson, my name is Connor. I'm the android sent by Cyberlife. I looked for you at the station, but nobody knew where you were. They said you were probably having a drink nearby. I was lucky to find you at the fifth bar. What do you want? You were assigned a case early this evening. A homicide involving a Cyberlife android. In accordance with procedure, the company has allocated a specialized model to assist investigators. Well, I don't need any assistance. Especially not from a plastic asshole like you. So just be a good little robot and get the fuck out of here. I understand that some people are not comfortable in the presence of androids, but I, I... am perfectly comfortable. Now back off before I crush you like an empty beer can. Listen, I think you should stop drinking and come with me. It'll make life easier for both of us. You know what? I'll buy you one for the road. What do you say? Bartender, the same again, please. See that gym wonders of technology. Make it a double. Honey and vinegar. Honey and vinegar. Oh. say homicide I did oh how this looks the computer doesn't Say, Lieutenant. Fucking name, that last thing. Conflicting orders and selecting priority. Follow him. <laughs> Josh Douglas from Channel 16. Can you confirm that this is a homicide? Oh, can't I? I, I want to scan more faces. That was fun. I'm not confirming anything. Androids are not permitted beyond this point. It's with me. Oh, I thought he. What part of stay in the car didn't you understand? Your order contradicted my instructions, Lieutenant. You don't talk, you don't touch anything, and you stay out of my way. Got it? Got it. Evening, Hank. We were starting to think you weren't going to show. 
Yeah, that was the plan till this asshole found me. So, you got yourself an android, huh? Oh, very funny. Just tell me what happened. We had a call around 8 from the landlord. The tenant hadn't paid his rent for a few months, so he thought he'd drop by, see what was going on. Hello. Ah. Uh. That's when he found the body. That would. That smell. It was even worse before we opened the windows. The victim's name's Carlos Ortiz. Oh. He has a record for theft and aggravated assault. Oh. According to the neighbors, he was kind of a loner. Stayed inside most of the time. They hardly ever. Red ice. Oh. Well, stay these in. Wasn't worth calling everybody out in the middle of the night. Gotta wait until morning. I'd say he's been there for a good three weeks. We'll know more when the coroner gets here. There's a kitchen knife over here. Probably the murder weapon. Any sign? Right blood. Never break in. Nope. The landlord said the front door was locked from the inside. All the windows were boarded up. The killer must have gone out the back way. What do we know about his android? Not much. The neighbors confirmed he had one, but it wasn't here when we arrived. Well, I, I gotta get some air. Make yourself at home. I'll be outside if you need me. like to look at that uh, writing, but the detective there, I don't want to bug him. Ooh, is that? Oh, he might have been stabbed in here. Hi. Hello. Yep, yeah, yeah, that's what I want. blood but I would say so we're taking samples for analysis dent violent impact area interesting oh I want full analysis on the narcotics. Consider it done, Lieutenant. Yeah. Detectives definitely correct on that, though. 
Cyber life hey, Mike, You finished taking samples there? Oof. Oof. Multiple stab wounds. But also was on narcotics. He's dead. Well, no fucking shit, he's dead. <laughs> he fell. He was stabbed after being cut. Yeah. He was stabbed 28 times. Yeah. Seems like the killer really had it in for him. Missing a piece of evidence. Just a sec, detective. There. Locked from the inside. Killer must have gone out this way. There are no footprints apart from Officer Collins' size 10 shoes. Well, this happened weeks ago. The tracks could have faded. No, this type of soil would retain a trace. Nobody's been out here for a long time. Meaning, didn't escape that way, or it didn't escape at all. saying there's something here. What? What are you... What do you want me to see? There we go. Excuse me, sir. Okay, excuse me, sir. Sir. Thank you. Hey, buddy. Turn. There you go. Lieutenant, I think I figured out what happened. Oh, yeah? Shoot, I'm all ears. It all started in the kitchen. There are 
obvious signs of a struggle. The question is, what exactly happened here? I think the victim attacked the android with the bat. That lines up with the evidence. Go on. The android stabbed the victim. So the android was trying to defend itself, right? Okay, then what happened? The victim fled to... the living room. Tried to get away from the android. All right, that makes sense. The android murdered the victim with the knife. Okay. Your theory's not totally ridiculous, but it doesn't tell us where the android went. It was damaged by the bat and lost some therium. Lost some what? Therium. You call it blue blood. It's the fluid that powers androids' biocomponents. It evaporates after a few hours and becomes invisible to the naked eye. Oh, but I bet you can still see it, can't you? Correct. Yeah. There you are. <laughs> yep, up there. Hey, 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 what are you doing with that chair? I'm going to check something. Uh, check something. This feels way more refined than Heavy Rain was. the ladder. Yeah, he didn't leave. But he also may not be completely functional. say it not because of basically I don't ah it is a male I don't know what it identifies as so I'll just keep it as it for now I see your red blink I was just defending myself. You 
just gonna kill me. I'm begging you. Don't tell him. Connor, what the fuck is going on up there? It's here, Lieutenant! I didn't get a choice. Oh, shit. Chris, Ben, get your asses in here now! Interesting. Huh. Okay. That's all I have time for today. Um, I'm really sorry for the, the short one, but I do like this game. Uh, maybe next week I'll have more than just two episodes. Who knows? Um, I will definitely have longer than this, but I will catch you all in the next one. Whenever that one may be. More than likely tomorrow, but I can't promise anything at this particular juncture. There's a lot of stuff happening in my life, um, and a lot of it is not exactly great. So, until next time, have fun, be safe, and aloha.